want to record a little video here. Um, this is uh, the week, the middle of the week following the Easter weekend. Um, this weekend, uh, just gone, will be remembered as the um, the weekend of the centenary of the uh, Easter 1916 Rising, which was the detonator, uh, which was the detonator event, so to speak, um, for the creation of the Irish Free State and subsequently for the um, Republic of Ireland. I'll be honest, I was, I've been dreading this weekend for a long time. Uh, I'm not a nationalist and I despise that needy, isn't it great to be Irish? You know, are we Irish great all the same? It's just the best little country in the world, so it is. Um, so, um, I, um, how is that different to, uh, to the Donald Trump, Sarah Palin stuff about, we're number one, we're number one. It's not. Same shit, different country. But I gotta say, uh, this weekend was actually really good. Um, the parade in Dublin on Sunday uh, and all the events branching off, branched off it, uh, were dignified, classy, well planned, well marshalled. Dublin looked wonderful and everyone played their part flawlessly. Um, stuff like that is theatre and like dance theatre it needs to be choreographed because if it's not it's just a country mess. And then the RTE concert on Monday night, the, the centenary concert, was so well done that it was a cherry on top of it all. Um, some of the musicians in that show I'd never heard of. Who was that guy who sang It, t it Took a Little Time in Kilmainham? What a fantastic song and what a fantastic uh, performance. And all those um, pre-recorded little sections were so well conceived and, and conceived and composed. In fact, what I liked most in the show was that section around the R mark where uh, they had that wonderful uh, audio film and video um, montage which has Yeats' Yates's voice going, I will arise and go now. And, um, and how he's, uh, we have been living way beyond our means. And Gay, Gay Burns talking about the, that poor little teenage girl who, um, who, uh, who died giving birth at the feet, at the feet of a, a Blessed Virgin Mary statue in Monaghan or Roscommon or Leitrim or wherever it was in the early 1980s. Um, um, and they had the voice of that guy who made that amazing, imp uh, he was a victim of clerical um, sex, sexual abuse, um, who made that amazing impromptu speech uh, on Question Time a couple of years back. And they had, the, you know, the voice of JFK and Obama and so on. It was a really good little five minute montage around the hour mark. Um, and, and that was followed by the um, Emel de May singing It's Not Easy to Be Green or It's Not Easy Being Green, which she did really, want, really, really well. Um, and it was witty and it was, uh, it's a Kermit the Frog song. <laughs> and it was clever uh, because um, putting those two things one after the other was not accidental. You, you can be sure of that. Um, it was... Um, it was a small little bit of critical um, self-reflectivity, five or ten minutes um, in an 85-minute show. Uh, but I'll take it, it was better, it's better than nothing. Altogether, so, altogether top class and um, um, really, really good, you know, um, really good show. So, hurrah for, for Ireland.